Click on the subscribe button and press the bell icon for watching more update videos. Thank you. Hello friends, welcome back to Seven Engineers YouTube channel. Dear friends, today my topic is about how to calculate cutting length for the rectangular step. So let's start it. This is the gable sketch for the beam or also for the column, you can suppose it, okay? Which X is 400 millimeter and Y is 300 millimeter, okay? So this is Y and this is X, okay? And dia of the stirrup, this stirrup, dia is, okay, 8 millimeter. And clear cover of the concrete, this one is 25 millimeter, okay? So, let's start how to find out cutting length for the stirrup, but for the rectangular stirrup, okay? Today our topic is. So, this is X, okay? So, I will find out the X value here. So, X, which is 400, okay? So, 400 millimeter subtract. Clear cover is 25 millimeter. But we have a both side, okay? Two side here. One is this one, okay? The second one is this one, okay? So, 2 multiply 25. But we will not take 25. That's why, because we will come to mid of the stirrup dial, okay? So, this is 8 millimeter, mid is 4 millimeter, okay? So, 25 plus 4, it will come 29, okay? So, 2 multiply 29. That's why, because the dial of the stirrup is 8 millimeter, half of the stirrup is 4 millimeter, okay? So, 4 plus 25, it will come 29, okay? So, 2. One is this side, the other one is this side. So, it becomes 2 and 29, okay? 25 plus 4, it becomes 29, okay? So, now, it will give us, what? Just, I will make calculator for the calculation. So, 2 multiply 29, okay? So, 2 multiply 29. It will comes 58 millimeter. Subtract 58, okay? So, uh, 400 millimeter subtract 58 millimeter, okay? 342 millimeter, okay? 342 mm, okay? So, this is the X side, okay? Now, I will find out the Y side, which is 300 millimeter. So, just write here 300 millimeter subtract. Same like this. One side, this one. The second one is this one. So, 2 multiply again 29, okay? So, we know 2 multiply 29, okay? It will comes 58, okay? So, 300 subtract 58. It will give us 224, okay, is equal to, sorry, 242, okay, mm, sorry for this, mm, both are mm, okay, not each other, okay, now, I will find out here what total cutting length for the step, okay, so, total Cutting length. One thing other. Between the two hooks, angle must be 35 degree. Okay, keep it in your mind. Also this side. 35 degree. Okay, so now total cutting length. Okay, for this, what I have to do here? Okay, so. First of all, cutting length, total cutting length. So, X, we have X multiply 2. That's why, because one side, this one, okay, one side length and second one, okay. So, X multiply 2 plus we have Y, okay, which is this one, okay. So, Y multiply 2, one this side, other one is this side, okay, so 2, then plus 
we have to add this length of the hooks. So one is this one, the second one is this one. Okay. So we have two number hooks. Okay. One and two. Two number. Okay. Multiply 10b to find out the length of this hooks. So we will take 10b. There is a diaster which is 8 millimeter and there is the constant value for this. Okay. And now I will subtract one thing other. That is when we want to when we make it cut off like this. Okay, so this is same like this here. Okay, so we will make cut off here band. Okay, so we will subtract the band. So because it will subtract from it. Okay, so it becomes same like this. Okay, so we will subtract. For this, we will just take two D. This is a part. There is a diameter diaster which is eight millimeter, and two is the constant value for this. Okay, so this is the same thing. Now we have how much numbers here? One band here. Second one is here. So one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So come here. We have five numbers. Multiply. What? We take here ten D for the hooks. Okay. And for the band, we will subtract five as a number of band and two as the constant and D as a diaphragm. Okay. So now. We will put the video here. X, we have 342. 342 multiply 2. Okay. Plus Y, which value is 242. Okay. So 242 multiply 2. This one. Okay. Plus 2 is same like 2 multiply 10 is the constant, D is a Die of stir, which is 8 millimeter. This one, keep in your mind, okay? Subtract 5 is the number of bands, okay? And 2 has a constant value, and D has a die of the stir, which is 8 millimeter, okay? Now, I will use calculator for the calculation here. How? 342 multiplied 2. 342 multiply 2 it will come 6 8 4 okay plus 242 242 multiply 2 4 84 plus 2 multiply 10 20 20 multiply 8 okay so 20 multiply 8 160 okay and subtract what this one okay 5 multiply 2 multiply 8 it will comes 80 okay so 80 now it will give us 6 84 plus 484 plus 160 is equal 1328 100 1328 subtract what 80 millimeter okay it will give us 1 2 4 8 millimeters so this is the cut length for the rectangular stirrup. Okay, this is the total cut length for the rectangular stirrup. And is equal divided by 1000. It will give us a meter. Okay. So 1.248 meters. So this is 